you were able to solve biology in 20 minutes and i know our uh, learners will be having this question in their head that how were you able to manage solve uh, to solve most all this paper in 20 minutes because it was actually a lengthy one there were a lot of statement based questions there were certain numericals as well that required a lot of analysis so what was i mean how you did it so sir i think giving repeated mock tests really helped me in this okay and i think when i gave the neat paper mm. all the 180 questions had been um, seen by me sometime earlier during okay. the course of mock test because mm-hmm. invariably when we give 100 mock tests huh. we i think cover almost all the types of questions all the possibilities are yes sir and uh, even in those tests we used to have six statements five statements how many of these are correct mm-hmm. not even combination how many 3 4 5 6 huh. that is a very difficult model but very we very were, difficult model yes <laughs> we were exposed to this sir and i'm really okay. um, thankful to my mm. institute for this okay. and ultimately in the neat exam hall i didn't find uh, biology very stressful Mm-hmm. except for that one botany question mm-hmm. i had kept it for end and i kept thinking multiple times about mm-hmm. it but i didn't get an answer i had to choose one of the <laughs> options yes i just chose fourth option i think ultimately it was third option so mm-hmm. this besides this question there was nothing um, which was out of ncert i believe out of ncert there was nothing but this paper was quite analytical yes, and uh, like you practice 100 mocks that's actually great but students usually don't do this much so this actually explains the importance of practice and uh, what is the most important thing is that if you know all the possible questions then there will be uh, no way that a neat exam can stop you from scoring not that well yes sir because i think in neat um, generally there is no new model which is out beyond uh, much beyond ncert yes. which is asked uh-huh. almost basic models mm-hmm. and in biology although this time assertion reason questions have been asked which mm-hmm. was a surprise to me as well in the exam mm-hmm. hall i think this time they were somewhat uh, straight forward mm-hmm. not as confusing as um, used to be asked in aims exam uh, but i'm generally very happy because uh, they actually you know uplifted the level of biology since last two years they were like biology was chal raha hai bas chalta hai yes, right? i think last year it was just uh, one sentence question one word options yes yes it was hardly 15 minute paper last yes. years yes. and uh, but this years i mean they uh, actually great but this time physics was actually easy part i suppose yes sir chemistry biology were somewhat on the higher side but physics mm. was uh, physics con- compensated for that yes. so one more thing which i would like to add is there is no toughest subject there is no easiest subject